this chorus of javascript complete guide chorus what you learn in this chorus let me know <coughs> uh, javascript complete guide you learn about the what is the documents console alert windows alert prompt let me introduce about myself my name is mohammed ismail i am working as a front developer and computer instructor last 5 years in different software companies and freelancing and also teaching different students all over worlds i have done bs in computer science what is the outline of the course what is the alert what is the document dot write what is the console dot log what is the loop what is the function what is the legal and illegal keywords there are a uh, few keywords which are few reserved keywords and legal you cannot use as a variable or function during you develop your own projects what is the variables what is the programming language there are uh, types of programming language like high level programming language and low level programming language what is the data types there are many data types when you call and declare the data types so these are the data types like number string uh, true false undefined nil these are data types you learn in these details in the course what is the nil what is the dynamic types javascript call the dynamic data type dynamic data type mean the data which you are define in your program like you define a number then you can update it has a character or true false or nil these called javascript dynamic data types what is the type of operators with type of operators you can find what is the type of data suppose the in data dynamic data type you have wrote the number then you update it is the character or the nil with help of data type of you can find it what it is the data type what is the statement expressions what is the reserved keywords what is the arithmetic operators what is the increment and decrements increments and decrements when used to add a few numbers in the results and decrement from one numbers in the result doing the working in the loops what is the string conversions what is the javascript engine before the javascript being popular uh, submitted in ecma there was when any developer developing any software so they have check uh, the code because that's not in cross plat cross browsers every browser have different uh, outputs of results therefore they not working same in every browsers what is the frameworks javascript frameworks what is the javascript libraries what is the compiler what is the interpreter what is the difference compiler and interpreters what is the output of the learning is this program after the learning that program you can become a javascript developers or javascript instructor you have command full command in javascript you can uh, work as a javascript developers in anywhere javascript is the world most popular web programming technology what is the low level language and high level language just few there i give you examples uh, low level language is the binary 0 and 1 understanding and high level language is the close to human that understanding the easy to programmers i explain the type of java that's the variable contain each data has that called data types Uh, data types there are few data types like number string boolean uh, nil undefined symbol these are data types javascript engine also we discuss about the javascript and learn it detail in the chorus javascript is the search engine which the browsers accept these engines what is the function why we use the function function is the programming language is a block of javascript code it is the same thing is called again and again when we uh, write a statement again 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 so the help of the function we call it anywhere just uh, once declare the function type of also explain
in this course you also have the codes of these programs uh, we uh, give you some examples and few codes available also the programs which help you to learn the programs what is the commenting system why we use the commands why important for commands in this program you have learned about it there is if else if the program have defined what is the if and else if if we make uh, the program for students if a student uh, score 80 percent the result will be a grade else if the result will be 70 percent if uh, the student if else student have uh, 60 percent then the console result is the 60 c otherwise else the result will be fail i have also guide you in the details how you can explain these also in functions or how call the function and how the work function if we wrote the one statement here we call it again help of the function you just call it the declare the function help of function you can find it easily according to your requirements where you want to display it you easily find it and declare it on the your performance where you want to display it now uh, come in the browser checks these the students the if else if we had declared the result the grade b in the console they are showing the result of the students they are the result of let's check the functions the we have declared the function in the program with help function the students result learn, hello dear students learn javascript they have declared the results here uh, the numbers there we declare the numbers in array help of the array we declare the numbers here they display the numbers the results of there we display the result in alert box there are many types you can uh, display the outputs like documents dot documents dot alert alert console dot log with help of the these outputs they help you to output the result according to users requirements and also i have uh, give you the files of these practicals you can help of these uh, projects which I have explained in there you have a uh, code of that you can practice according to your requirements these are the course and after completion these courses you be able has a become a software developer a java developer a front-end developer thank you very much see you in course complete guide course in this program you will learn about the javascript what is the javascript javascript was first known as a life script but NetScript has changed the name of JavaScript possibly because of the existing being generated by Java. JavaScript made was first appear in NetScape 2.0 in the 1995 with the name of LifeScript. The general purpose core of the language has been embedded NetScape. JavaScript is a dynamic computer programming language. It is the first web computer programming language which used for interact with webs html and css it is the lightweight and most commonly used as a part of web page it is the lightweight easy to use and most widely used for web pages all kind of web pages use javascript mostly javascript allow client signed script to interact with the user and make dynamic page with with help of javascript you can make the page dynamic any animation any interact you can help of javascript make it easy it is the interpreted programming language with the object oriented capabilities which have object oriented capabilities you can modify change any words according to your requirements which uh, you use the uh, project uh, object oriented programming client side javascript client side javascript is the most common from the language the javascript should be include reference with the html document for code be interpreted by the browsers it's use html editor and css it means that web page need not be static html but include the programs that interact with the user control browsers and dynamically create html what is the chorus outlines which you learn in the javascript what is the alert what is the document dot right what is the console what is the loop what is the function what is the legal and legal keywords what is the variable what is the javascript programming what is the programming language what is the data type what is the string what is the number what is the undefined what is the nil what is the undefined 
these things you learn about there. What is the dynamic types? What is the state expression? What is the reverse keyword? What is the arithmetic operators? What is the increment and decrement? What is the JavaScript engine? The JavaScript engine is the which engine which used in the browsers and execute the code on the browser. JavaScript actually run in the browsers. What is the framework and libraries? How many frameworks and libraries in JavaScript? What is the compiler? What is the interpreter? What is the difference between compiler and interpreter? Why we use the interpreter in JavaScript? After completion the chorus you'll be able to work as a JavaScript developers because the JavaScript is most demanded and most popular web programming technologies. Data types. There are many data types. Few of the most popular uh, data types use other uh, function and objects. Number, string, true and false, nil, undefined, symbol. These are data types of JavaScript which use in the JavaScript programming language engine what is the javascript engine most popular the browsers use javascript engines but few have their own engines like javascript engine the v8 what is the name of javascript engine it is the v8 safari have uh, their own uh, engine it is called netro firefox have uh, spider monkey these have on ja uh, javascript engines Thank you very much. See you in next lectures. In this chorus, I will teach you introduction of programming language. What is the programming language? Why we need to learn the programming language? What kind of programming language there are? Let's... Programming language. We need to give instruction to computer. When we want to give the computer instructions, so therefore we need some way how can instruction to computer because computer cannot understand direct our language. So therefore we need some language with help of that language we give computer instruction to understand our way. A programming language is a formal language which compress a set of instruction that produce various kind of output. The programming language is set of instruction. Suppose we write some function in programming language. So that function suppose 2 equal to 5 output will be the 7. These code of instruction we give to computer. So the computer uh, uh, understand that instruction of our then give us output of that which we have written and give them instruction. We need programming language in computer programming for the same reason. There are many reasons we need to uh, instruct computer according to our requirements. What kind of program we want? Suppose we are going to make point of sale software. So that point of sale software, what are information give the customer or shopkeeper to the using screen front end screen to uh, calculate add input the data information to the customer suppose a customer buy a product from the customer so that it enter that product and automatically which we have done programming in that software they calculate and give the reports and uh, also available for print section you can print the bill we need to natural language our every life to communicate simply because we want to communicate for simply for easy understanding because computer not understanding our language <coughs> programming language act like a bridge or translator between human and computers because the computer only understand zero and one don't understand any human language that programming language is the one way which a performing role has a bridge to between human and computers that help us to communicate with computer every computer run with help of programming language
Programming language is vocabulary and a collection of rules that command a computer device application to work according to the written code. Whatever programmer, if uh, you are becoming a programmer, so what of vocabulary and collection of words, commands you give to the computer, they perform all devices of computer perform according to your rules, your instructions, what instructions you give to computers. These are set of codes. There are many codes. Depend on the programming, which of programming you are learning. Thank you very much. See you in next lecture. Thank you very much.